Hello everyone and welcome back to Seeing Stars DLC for a little to the left. Today we're going to do puzzle 18, which is the ink jars one. And this one has two different puzzles. And the first thing you need to know about this puzzle is the, at first glance, when you first touch these, you think that they can only spin. Um, it took me a lot longer than I want to admit to know that you can actually pick them up by their tops and move them around. This is very important. Okay. So for the very first one, what you're going to do is you're gonna find the drips that match up. So I believe there's a one that has one drip, two drips, like three drips going down. So just find all of them and get them to be facing out so that you can see what you're doing. All right, so what I know is this drip is going to be a top jar. And then, so is this strip. And so is this one because it doesn't go all the way through. Um, and then I know this one's gonna be a bottom jar because it ends, right? Same with this one and same with this one. And then it's a matter of lining them up to the right jar that fits. Like this one doesn't line up right? with that one. So we're gonna pick it up and move it over here. Go, okay, it does line up with this one. So this one's correct with that. I'm looking at the top of this and going, okay, this one's gonna move over here. Now that one's done. All right, next one. So we've got this, which has double lines. That does line up. This one does not. So we're going to then move it there. And then it's a matter of lining up these last jar, like so. So once you have the drips done, we have one more puzzle to do. And I actually think this one's the hardest one. You're gonna be looking at the labels and you're gonna look at the label style. So this one's mostly straight across. So I'm gonna bring that down and find the other one that's like straight across. This one. Okay. So it's very important for these to work from bottom up. Once you've gotten the idea, work from the bottom up. Otherwise, you're going to be messing up the ones that you solve on the top, etc. All right, these might not still be in the right place. This one kind of looks like it's an ending. So we're looking to have the entire label shown from end to end, and we're lining it up perfectly to match. One might not be the correct one, or it might go over here. Let's see, aha, it does, okay. So it goes like this. So here's the full label on the bottom. You see how it makes one nice label? That's what you're trying to do with all three of them. This took me such a long time to figure out, I tell you. I'm gonna find the ones that are similar in style. That one's not quite right. I started with the straight ones because those were easiest to spot for me. I don't know what ones are easiest for you guys, but start with the ones that make the most sense to you. I don't think this jar is in the right spot at all. That does not feel like an end. It feels like a middle piece or an end piece like over here. This feels like it might be an end. Okay, let's see if we can work with that somewhere. Oh, 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 this one lines up. Okay, we've got something lining up. This is good. Okay, I think this one goes with it maybe. So it's a matter of finding the right spots. Okay, that looks pretty good. Let's see, I might have to do some like end finagling to make them line up really nicely, but let's see what we can do. That lines up, that lines up okay, all right. This one doesn't feel like it fits. <laughs> 
frustrating. Okay, perhaps it goes in the center. No, that doesn't feel right. I'm getting the idea that this one's wrong. It feels like I lined it up, but it's not quite right. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 like that. Okay, I had the wrong one. Look how simple, like, they can look so similar. Okay. So, from here... There you go. Once you get all three of the labels lined up, they don't have to be exactly the right size on both edges or anything. You need the label pictures themselves to be seamless like that. Anyway, thanks for joining me on today's Daily Tidy. See you guys in the next one.